Let's go straight into the point, we are in the Final Cut Pro interface and we have the two clips that we want to create, the long cross dissolve transition. As you can see I have placed the two clips and if I go into the transitions here and drag the cross dissolve and try to place it between the clips, it will tell me that there is not enough extra media beyond clip edges to create the transition and I can create the transition. So basically what that means is that as you can see here on this clip with the red line, this is the end of the first clip. And here, we don't have enough space on the next clip to create the transition. So in order to be more manageable when we do transitions, I'm gonna trim the first clip here, and then I'm gonna trim the second clip, as you can see here, on where I want the transition to happen. Now I will drag the cross dissolve, place it between the clips, and I will double click in the transition. And now you can see that I can drag here and create the transition a little bit longer or much longer or how much long I want it to be. And then when I double click again, I can go here, adjust accordingly and on the inspector panel, I can set the ease amount, how ease I want the transition to be, the fade in type and the fade out for the cross fade of the audio, and of course, how I want the ease to be in, out, etc. So, different settings. Let's see that by default how it is. You see that it creates a slow, long cross dissolve that it's great if we want to create memories in your video, for example, reading the book and remembering how great it was or imagining how great it would be in the ocean. Now, if I select this, I can set the ease amount. Let's say I want an only in ease with 50 and check this out, how it's gonna be. It's more smooth on the in and we don't have an ease on the out of the transition and you can experiment with any of the settings here on the inspector panel to match your taste. A very quick and easy tutorial so you can understand how we can extend and create long cross dissolve transitions. I hope you found this video helpful, you learned something new today and if you did as a reward don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel for more content like this one. Thank you so much for watching, I'm Emilio and I will see you in the next video.